So we've got in the facility about 4,000 tanks like these of sort of different sizes. So what we can do using zebrafish is to induce damage to myelin in the living animal. Now these zebrafish that we study are tiny. They're tiny and transparent and we can use genetic tools to make various cells in the nervous system fluoresce. So we can actually use powerful microscopes to directly image and look into the brain and see how myelin damage unfolds. So we've already found drugs that are reducing myelin damage and this is super exciting. Does that mean potentially there could be drugs available that may cure MS? Right, well that's the hope. If those drugs are as effective in people as they have proven to be in various animal models, then I think there's real hope that once we know exactly how to treat people, that we can help boost the myelin repair and undo some of the damage caused by disease.